we're, we've been doing different things with corn, soybeans. Uh, just a couple of things we've been doing. Number one, we've been working with Bioforge on corn. Last year we impregnated it on the seed. Uh, we did that with corn and soybeans. Definitely saw an increase in root mass. Did see a little bit of a bump in yield. Uh, some places we didn't see a bump in yield. Some places we saw a considerable amount. So it averaged out. We, we did pull a couple extra bushels from the product. It did, we did make money on it. Uh, another thing we started trying is, uh, and pretty good success, on double crop soybeans, we've been going in uh, with Warrior insecticide. Your growing window on double crop beans, especially after wheat, is rather small. You got to keep those plants as healthy as you possibly can. So uh, of all the different things we've tried, I think we saw our best response going with an insecticide. You know, you could have you can have a lot of pressure. It could be dry, that could be one stress, and then if you have a hatch of grasshoppers, grasshoppers will start chewing, a lot of other different bugs chewing on the soybeans. So you're gonna start losing a lot of leaf mass and, and uh, the short season beans, they, they can't afford to lose that. So I, I would say we have seen on an average year, I would say we see a three to five bushel jump just by doing a application of Warrior when we're, and we're already going through the field, so it's just a matter of putting it in the tank when we do our cleanup work.